All right, so we got Diablo 4, Vessel of Hatred, official cinematic launch trailer. Let's get to the video. Let's go. Get right to it, man. We all know Diablo 4's uh, cutscenes, like cinematic cutscenes or whatever, hit absolute different. So. Oh, is that Kratos? I think that shirt's too big. What is she read? Is she reading off a William Shakespeare script? What's going on? We have each played a part in what has happened here. Kratos? Friends. You told her you trusted her more than yourself to do what she thought was right. You abdicated your choice to this. Suffering was That was hard. I'm, hey, hey, I'm gonna be honest with you. Listen, I tell y'all this all the time. I've been telling y'all this since last year, right? There's only so much games I can play, you know, because, bro, listen, we got 365 days. I'm one human. And, and there's so many games that come out every single year. There's only so many games that I can play, bro. But whenever it comes to Diablo, I have not gotten to that game yet. Um, I, I'm stuck on uh, on covering other games. I'm, I'm making videos all day long, but also I'm trying to squeeze in like some time of video games. So, um, to be honest with you, I have not got I have not uh, gotten to uh, Diablo 4 yet, but I have seen gameplay. I do know what the game is now. Um, last year, I was just completely like just just blank space whenever it came to Diablo because you know I never really played the game before. I heard of the name, but I never really played it before. I, I actually know like other content creators and streamers you know who actually play the game and stuff but again i never played this so um you know seeing like the uh cutscene, and i think bro bro a lot of you guys actually liked it you know um last year bro i didn't know what i was talking about i don't think i've said anything i, I like whenever i come into these videos especially if, if it's for a game that i don't know bro i'm not gonna sit here and act like i know what i'm talking about bro it, bro if i'm confused if i'm like new to this franchise whatever i'm gonna say it I'm not going to sit here and say, oh, well, you know, uh, because this is how this goes. And that's like, no, bro. Like, I, bro, I, I'm not, <laughs> bro, I'm a blank space whenever it comes to some games, you know? And I think that's natural, you know? I don't, I don't think, you know, I'm some type of video game connoisseur where I know what everything, like, I don't know, like, where everything happens in, like, every single video game. Like, I'm not, like, a, I'm not a prophet, bro. Like, I'm not a, you know, I'm not a, like, a, like, I'm not a professional at this. But uh, if I'm being honest with you, bro, I did love uh, Diablo's cutscenes. Uh, from last year and this year, um, I don't know how this game did number wise. I, I mean, well, obviously, bro, the, the Diablo fan base is really strong. So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking, or I, I, well, I hope this game did really good. Um, I think this is like a, correct me if I'm wrong, but I think this is like a DLC for Diablo Four because I think Diablo Four came out last year, 
and um, I think there's like a DLC for the game or like an expansion pack for the game. So um, if, if, if I'm being completely honest with you, um, I do like the cutscenes, the actual gameplay itself. I do like the uh, gameplay. It's just I literally haven't gotten time to like get to Diablo 4. It's crazy because like, you know, and again, I'm only one guy. There's not 10 of me. I'm one guy. You know, there's so many video games coming out, so I, I couldn't get to the game. But comment down below, man. What do you guys think about uh, this whole like DLC slash expansion pack or whatever? Um, and I believe I actually did check out uh, a Diablo 4 Vessel of, ha uh, Vessel of Hatred trailer. Was it like a month ago? It was like a month or two ago. Um, it was like the girl, bro. She was, bro. She was. It was like it was like this. She was. Uh, whenever she she was going through this. Give me one second. Where's she at? When she was going through this right here, when she was screaming in the, in the pain and stuff like that, because she was getting impaled and stuff like that. That yeah, that's the trailer that I watched. So um, um, yeah, I can't lie to you. And like that cinematic scene that I watched like previously before, like two months ago, whatever. That was like kind of hard to watch, bro. She was getting all types of stretched out and everything. I mean, not in that way, obviously, dirty minded brain person. Um, but yeah, like it, it was crazy, man. Comment down below, man. What do you guys think about this cinematic trailer? And uh, I think the expansion or DLC, whatever you guys want to call it, launches today. So um, hopefully you guys are excited about that. I'm excited for like, un, you know, listen, I'm excited for Until Dawn. Uh, that drops on October 4th. Uh, and I think the actual the actual, um, launch trailer drops today. So I'm actually going to cover that and see what that's like. Because, bro, once October 4th comes through, bro, a lot of Until Dawn videos will be dropping. Um I mean, I, I don't know if, if it's going to get yellow marked or whatever because of, like, all, like, the deaths or whatever. But hopefully it doesn't because, bro, I love Until Dawn. It's dropping on the PC and PlayStation 5. So pretty excited about that game. But other than that, man, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like the video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. And 